Hi, this is Sondarya Sharma and you're watching me on Filmy Beat. Yes, well, I was studying and doing my internship when Rachi Diaries happened. Yeah. Are you watching the current season of Big Boss by any chance? No. No? <laughs> I don't. Oh, okay. <laughs> on the contrary, I'll tell you, I've never seen Big Boss ever in my <laughs> life. I just ended up being there and being a part of an amazing show and honestly, it has done wonders to me. So, I think calm se hi kaam aata hai. Somewhere. Right. And definitely the hustle is on. I still go meet a casting director, sir. I am here. This is my portfolio. Now, portfolio is not required. I was like, wow. <laughs> the fact that I'm a part of it, you know, yeah. itself is a thing for me. So, I'm just like uh, very, very excited and thrilled about sharing the screen space. You know, it's not a dream. Nahi hota hai. Right. Hi guys, welcome to Filmy Bate with Filmy Beat. This is Murtaza Iqbal. And with me, there is an actress who has been on big screen, TV, and OTT. She has been on every place. She has left her mark. And she has one of the most beautiful smiles, I would say. And we both share a dimple also. So, <laughs> Good way to tell me that you have a dimple. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe if you did marks, I have that. So, oh, guys, yeah. of course, we have a lot of things. And the gorgeous Sondere Sharma. Hi, Sondere. Welcome Hi. to Filmy Beat. Hi. First of all, I would like to start by saying this. लोग ना एक सुपरस्टार के साथ काम करने के लिए से वेट करते हैं। तीन सुपरस्टार्स के साथ स्क्रीन स्पेस केयर स्केयर शर्ट चुके हैं आप। How does that feel? I mean, I want to know तीनों के साथ actually शूट करने का मौका मिला ग्रीन स्क्रीन था, but फिर भी watching yourself with that three superstar in one ad is also very big deal. How does that feel? Oh, first of all, it feels amazing. Trust me when I say that. The little girl in me is so very excited because from the time I you know, एक होता नहीं होश संभाल रहे हो आप, so I always dreamt of making it big and you know manifestation really works. I want to do something which is unprecedented and I'm so privileged and humbled that I got to share the screen space with the bestest of boys of our country and the biggest superstars. And Shahrukh sir wasn't there at that time. And Akshay sir's shoot happened differently. Otherwise, I we shot Ajay sir was around. Right. And it is amazing, mm. amazing as a feeling that while I'm sitting and talking to you, I'm like, ha, matlab seriously, <laughs> it had an impact. So yeah, I'm really, really grateful. So when you saw that ad, when it was proper, ban ke aaya hoga, as you said that Ajay sir was around, but Akshay sir and Shahrukh. When you saw that ad, and of course you were like kind of interacting with them, how was that feeling? You know, the first time when you saw the whole ad properly. Honestly, I saw the ad when it got properly aired. Yeah. yeah. And when when they posted it, and I was like, wow, <laughs> the fact that I'm a part of it, you know, yeah. itself is a thing for me. So I'm just like uh, very very excited and thrilled about sharing the screen space. You know, kiska dream nahi hota hai, and it's one of the tick marks that the dream has come true, and my journey has just begun. Yes. So I think God is very kind. Right. You know, as you said, your journey has just begun, but but you have done everything. OTT movie and of course with Big Boss you were also part of television. I would like to know when you started as you know how this thing happened because you also know that you were a, you were a dentist. Yeah. You know how did this acting ka kida happen? Of course you are so gorgeous. Koi bhi aapko role de dega. There is no question <laughs> about so it. Kind. But uh, how did this happen? Okay, now I have to start becoming an actor. So I always wanted to be an actor because we used to get fascinated. I used to get fascinated by seeing people on the screen. For me, it was like a wow moment. And I come from a very educated family where entertainment isn't given a priority as in. But it isn't looked and seen as one of the professions. So for them, it was a shocker. And even for me as a shocker, because I had never ever imagined that I would be ever uh, you know, able to uh, actually share yeah. the screen space to begin with. Yes, well, I was studying and doing my internship when Rachi Diaries happened. Yeah. And uh, I did Rachi Diaries, and I auditioned, and that's how I came to Bombay. I did grooming, diction, and everything happened, cutting long story short. Uh, then I thought that I can really do better, you know, because since I have a logical yeah. brain and I like to work on myself, that's when I decided that I would go to Los Angeles to study acting. At least to break my inhibition as an actor. Because for me, it's very important uh, to be recognized by your work. Looks and everything, definitely, you yeah. have to have those. It goes without saying. But I think to be able to do and let people consume my content itself was a thing for me. And when I came back, I signed 
two, three OTT shows and God was kind, like I said. So I was the lead of the shows and they all got released while I was inside the Big Boss house, except the yeah, Raktan yeah. show. And it's got the maximum number of viewership amongst all the OTT shows being shown till yes. today. So God has been kind and on the contrary, I'll tell you, I've never seen Big Boss ever in my <laughs> life. And I am just not a that kind of a person, person who yeah. would watch and into too much of... I just ended up being there and being a part of an amazing show. And honestly, it has done wonders to me. People who didn't even know about my work initially. Now, I get mopped for the pictures. Even while coming and getting down yeah. here. It's a surreal feeling. So I think somewhere that thing of seeing myself on the screen while I was studying dentistry, cut to doing Ranchi Diaries, then going to Los Angeles, yeah. like it got in so serious. My papa was like, what is wrong with you? <laughs> All of my relatives thought that, Are, ye to kisi ke or something. you know how yeah. these things are. But I am actually a very different, I was always a very different kid like mentally yeah. I could not um, think see the way mommy would be but <laughs> did I so yeah. my, in a good stride yes, yeah. but then today they are I, I see I, I feel very happy when my father is so happy to see me on the screen and in the hand when he's like hey so they call me Nanu Nanu I had I had like oh wow you know we get excited yeah. that excitement is amazing because we have all seen them we have grown up seeing yeah. all of them true you know, uh, Ranchi Diaries was your first film. I remember you had the been, only film. Yeah, only film. And of course, then you had a cameo recently in Thank God. Yeah, yeah. Thank God. Yeah. So, yeah. you know, I would like to know that. Oh, definitely. How can I say only film? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, yeah. One of the funniest yeah. scenes in that yeah. movie. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and I was inside the house. Yeah, and they had to the promote house. also. Yeah, oh, that yeah, was such a high moment for me. <laughs> yes. Oh, yes. Yes. I remember you were even nominated for Best Debutant in a couple of award functions and yes. people liked your performance in that but the movie couldn't do well at the box office. How did you take that failure, you know, because first film, Anupam Sir was I think producing, presenting or producing the film yeah. at that time. How was that, was it a bit set back ke yaar, ab main kya karungi? Uh, honestly, I didn't think about because when I came here, I had no clue about the industry. For me, being able to follow my passion itself was a thing and to be able to work with such diggers like Anupam sir, Late yeah. Sadeesh sir, uh, Jimmy sir. Yeah. For me, it was something surreal that, oh, wow, aise bhi hota hai. So, uh, is cheez ko waise socha nahi. I was really excited because that, back then I realized Akshay sir had come to release the teaser of my film, Rohit Shetty sir, Mahesh Bhatt sir. Matlab, it was a, like a celeb fest for me. So, I was like, wow, you know, excited. So back then, akal bhi thi, oh, paps bhi hote hai, oh, post bhi karna hai, and all that. So coming back from that, that moment to this, thinking and analyzing ki it did well or did it didn't, didn't do well, uh, actor ki job hoti hai to be able to perform and to yeah. be able to be seen on the screen. So us waq, itna mujhe nahi tha. Definitely, uh, koi kisi ko bhi chahiye ki that you know your film does wonders yes, great at box office and who doesn't want that hits in a row uh, having said that i think her, her film ki ek kismat hoti hai fate hoti hai for me the bestest part was to be part of a film and start my career right so you know uh, you just said uh, earlier that big boss changed your life how has it changed it what opportunities do you do you feel you got after you became a part of that uh Actually, God is kind. I was getting opportunities before too. And most of my work which has come out during and after yeah. is shot before Big Boss. And is signed before Big Boss. Uh, after Big Boss, of course, the bandwidth increased. Even in tier 2, tier 3 or wherever I go. Uh, the acknowledgement, the love and how much love of God. That, oh, we loved you. People got to know me as a person. And uh, of course, is mere parameters jo the har cheese ke it, it it broke all the shackles of whatever you think because a lot of people used to say ki big boss me to ab tab jaate ho jab whatever. For me, I had no inhibition. A, I don't come from this profession acting. B, uh, I've I've never seen big boss before, so I had no notion. All I knew that people go and fight. 
So I thought I'm going to conduct in a manner the way I am. Yeah. I don't have to be loved by the cameras in a manner. If you are good, any which way people are going to love you, camera is going to love you. So my entire, if you have seen Big Boss, I haven't seen my own episodes. I but I just love. I'm an ardent fan of Big Boss since really? season one to season seventeen. I try to finish my wrap up my work and oh, go home before I'm ten because I want to watch Big Boss. Wow! <laughs> like, that but I haven't fan. seen ever any Big Boss, not even my shows. Yeah. And uh, for me, so that was my. Uh, so you didn't think of coming out and watching episodes by any chance? No, 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 because I've lived those moments, and also the kind of uh, days I was there. I didn't want to become bitter as a person whosoever said anything about right. me. And for me, it's like let go, let go, let go. So it's just I've been there, I've experienced this. Okay, fine. Right. So are you watching the current season of Big Boss by any chance? No. No. <laughs> I don't. Oh, okay. <laughs> I don't know. I'm a fan of because I'm watching every episode okay, right now. Nice. You know, it happens that you know a lot of times these people they call back you know old contestants if they give you a chance to be back. Not this season, maybe later also. Yeah. To come back as a wild card or a, or rejoin as a senior Correct. or something. Would you like to go back? I haven't honestly thought about it at all. And as of now, I mean, from the time I'm out, I'm just busy working on something. So I haven't thought of it at all as of now. But we'll see future. Me, kya hoga? We never say never. Since I've right. I've never seen Big Boss, Murtaza, and I ended up doing, doing Big, Boss. Big Boss. Can you imagine? Yes. So never say never. Right. You know, as you said, one film only as a lead. Why that one film, Sandhya? Aren't you getting good offers, or you yes, are being I choosy? Am. I am being choosy, and I am getting films. God is very very kind, and uh, you will hear lots very soon. I'm being very particular because I always believe in doing. Something more substantial, quality over just quantity. Because I always feel that, your right decision about this career, this career is such that yeah. you cannot be. This is what I feel uh, about my career. Even for the uh, the OTT uh, shows I have done, I've been the lead of three shows, yeah. and they were completely de-glamorized kind of shows. And I wanted to do those because the kind of image that Instagram creates for you as a person, yeah. the glamorous this and that, it overshadows of the 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 fact that you are here as an actor an actor's job is to just get you know how it just completely merge yourself into the character become that character so i generally take my uh, acting profession seriously having the fun part of it but yeah i've been a little picky about little uh, this thing Right. Yeah, and the time actually I entered right after that I went to Los Angeles, so I didn't okay. have yeah. much this thing. And by the time I was back, pandemic was there. Pandemic had occurred for two years, but still I think I got lucky and I got two, three great right. shows. And now Big Boss, and now we're talking, yes. and hopefully something really so. You know, Sandhya, so a lot of people who are not from the industry, who, are, uh, who doesn't have you know a father who has been in the industry or something like that, they have always told me that you know. They were supposed to be part of a film or something, and at the end moment, a yeah. star kid was given that opportunity, or someone who is more better known. Yeah. Did you face any such thing till now in this whole journey of yours? I want to be honest, and yes, I did. But having said that, I have nothing against the makers or anybody for that matter, because I think the best thing comes to you when you are apt for it. God has, I think, decided everything for you. So we have to understand that what suits them and. Works best for the project as well. Yeah. So I'm I'm not going to talk anything which is uh, you know which takes into a direction which doesn't work. Like we, we have to really understand that what makers go through when they write a script and right. when they understand and whether you're sellable and how much is your uh, I would say uh, presentation wise the weightage of it. So it works in totality. It's not just one as a person. And the biggest example of it is me doing this ad. Yeah. Right. So I think uh, instead of there are there, there are all sorts of stories right now. And honestly, I am I am an eternal optimist. I always look at the sunny side of everything. If I wasn't, and if I was focusing more on the other right. aspect of it, I wouldn't have grabbed this opportunity. Correct. So. You know, Sandhya, how much whatever informal meetings that we have had earlier, I have yeah. I have marked one thing. You have a very strong personality. Thank now, you. a lot of times it happens that you know when you go and meet casting directors, Correct. maybe sometimes we 
casting couch has always been something that people do mm. talk about yeah i know you must have slapped people if someone must have done you that one thing i can say for sure but have you faced it and how did you tackle it of course apart from the slapping thing the slapping thing <laughs> no, well i think i mean have you faced it hopefully no i hope the answer is no see, but if you have how did you tackle it i have always met great people in my life and i always feel you always meet people with the energy you carry like i said the industry is full of all sorts of experiences yeah. but nobody is hounding you nobody is raping you if you don't want to hug someone nobody is going to force themselves on right. you so this is what i personally feel and my experience is i've met good people work or no work that is secondary if you fit the bill definitely you're a part of it if you don't you're not in fact you would be amazed to know the the film i got initially ranchi diaries was completely out of blues i was just doing my theater in delhi and i was auditioned and i came to bombay and i happened to meet the director of my film right. then even for my ott shows i was being cast because they saw my uh, those uh, directors saw oh, my yeah. uh, performance in that thing in ranchi diaries so i think kaam se hi kaam aata hai somewhere right and definitely the hustle is on i still go meet uh, casting directors so i am here this is my portfolio now portfolio is not required it's yes. just you have to just go and touch base so if you fit the bill they will cast you right so, so definitely i think it's person to person and i've met great people and i think industry is full of great people too it's quite somewhere so happy to hear this positive answer it's very rare thing to hear because a lot of because people do have see what is that i can yeah. go on and say oh it's not it doesn't take away the fact it's why this something yeah yeah so it doesn't take away the fact that i don't have my lows right. i have my lonely days when i get up in the morning i'm like what am i up to what am i going to do because every day we are not reading the scripts True. i've left a profession i was doing my internship from a government hospital and cut to from that to here when i was a cast the film so it takes a lot pehle se to aapko sabse bada achamba hoga hai sunke ki mujhe sabse zyada ego problem hota tha jab koi mujhe doctor saab nahi bolta tha kyunki hamare colleges mein doctor saab karke address kiya jata hai but matlab from first year itself to wohi culture cultivate kiya jata hai so it was like ha audition hai aa jao baith jao 50 50 log hain and uske baad you won't believe maine hardly kabhi ek bar ad ko audition diya hoga i had never ever auditioned for an ad before until this this one happened god is so kind i i can't believe it so i think when you put your foot down and tell yourself this is what i want i've always looked for a quality work and that's what i think everyone does right so yeah so of course we have spoken about everything your journey big boss yeah. now i want to know when i mean when are we going to see you back on the big screen i mean very soon very I soon think yes any time soon <laughs> is it i mean have yes. you already shot something that i'm hinting at that well oh uh, well all i can say is any time soon worth is up Okay. Any any other projects where you can speak about about your upcoming projects if you want to? Then you want to talk to me, na? Then you want to interview me if I talk right now. <laughs> you know, I can just come and talk to you at oh, home yeah, if you yeah, want. Oh yeah, for sure. <laughs> But no, definitely, uh, we shall be discussing this in no time. Actually, is it? Yes. 